Hey, what is going on everyone? And sorry for not being on here for a while. Uh, a lot of weird stuff going on in my life, but uh, it's all good. Just gotta keep working through everything. And uh, you know, just like everybody else does. But uh, we're up here in New England, super nice day. It's just uh, getting light out here, 6.55. Getting light later and later, it sucks. Clocks are getting switched back, uh, I think in a couple days. But yeah, we are gonna go out, ride MX-101 today, have a great time. My uncle's gonna ride his 250F Honda 14, 2014 Honda, I should say. And I'm gonna ride my 2020 Honda 450. So it'll be really cool. Uh, my dad just got shoulder surgery um, a couple weeks ago, so he's not able to ride, but he did come up. So that's really, really awesome. And we got the bike right here. Moto suspension on it, no free ride, Supercross setup. Um, so yeah, it'll be the fourth ride on the bike total and second ride on the suspension just moto setup so it's cool i'm gonna check the sag today get it all dialed in but we're gonna go out fishing right now then come back do some bike work and get to mx 101 by around 10 o'clock because that's what time they open so let's have a fun day okay so getting a little bit of bike work done love this thing so much can't wait to ride it today once again and really excited to honestly get some graphics on it um, as soon as possible, I think. Probably next week, I just talked to a different company. Um, MGX went MGX, sorry, went out of business. So um, yeah, I got hooked up with a new company. Shout out to uh, one of my buddies, Jesse Pierce, for uh, letting me know, you know, the name of the company. And uh, yeah, beautiful fall day out here. The track should stay moist. We'll get ready to rip it up. Carmine and my dad are still out on the boat fishing. I came back in, just gonna change the oil, air filter, and um, check over a couple things, spokes, whatnot, and then load the bike back up in the truck and head over to the track. Okay, so bike work is done. Salvatore. They're back from the boat. What's up? The yellow button's a high idle. Salvatore, you call me Salvatore. Yeah. Yeah, start it like that. Could I call you Salvatore too? What? I'm gonna call you Salvatore. Right there it goes. Like a redneck in that dude. You got the redneck shit on. Alright, we're gonna load up the bikes and uh, head out to MX101. Let's do it. Let's unload these babies. Carmine with the thick spokes on his bike. My old bike, I miss this thing. How's she handled, Jonas? Pretty good, I don't blow out any spokes anymore. That's weird. <laughs> nice Raptor pegs. These things are so beautiful. How's the track? Oh, it was good. <laughs> My dad didn't get me taking you out over there. You didn't get it? No, oh, I don't think so. No. I, dude, I wish I had the GoPro on for that one. So I was trying to I was trying to pass Carmine and I Ran him high in the corner and he tried to check up and go under me, but I thought he had it and he clipped my back wheel and then rolled down the big ass berm <laughs> over there uh, right before the one tabletop. So I'll have to throw the GoPro on next time, uh, next session out and not be so nice. <laughs> All right, well, this is awesome. I over jumped that triple and I didn't even notice. I bent the crap out of my rim. Taco did a little bit, but at least it's still, uh, it's still rideable, which is good and I didn't freaking pull a Darren Durham and go over the bars. Check out how the back is.
All right, so now we are in mode two. I honestly did not know what modes to set the bike in. Mode two is the least aggressive one, and I thought mode three was, but my dumbass didn't actually read the book, so I should have did that.
Thank you. Bike's a lot better. Yeah. Yo, thank you for oh. showing me how the bike works. Yeah. <laughs> so I really didn't know how my bike worked. Uh, I had it in the wrong mode. I thought it was mode three was this like most smooth and mode one was the most aggressive, but actually mode two is the most smooth mode, like mellow. And then mode one, more aggressive. Mode three, most aggressive. So I did the most aggressive mode the whole time I've been riding it. My fourth ride on it, but um, it was super awesome. We tried out traction control the last uh, little session. We didn't film it at all, but uh, it was amazing. You could just dump the clutch basically and let it eat, and it just kind of wants to plant to the ground, get traction. I would totally recommend anybody that has never ridden, you know, a new 2020 or 19, whatever they came out with it, uh, to, you know, definitely try that. But we're gonna head out of here soon, and uh, you know, just get packed up. Find a little food or something and just uh, have a good rest of the night. Dude, why didn't I get the camera out? You just crashed on the hoverboard. You're gonna bust your shoulder. I thought you landed on the bad no, one. I landed on my right side. <laughs> Would you have like right. torqued, torqued your shoulder and ripped it? What's that? No, no, no. It would have been, uh, actually, really wouldn't have mattered too much because it's my bicep that I have to be careful with. That's really it. All right, we're headed out of here. So it was a good day and uh, definitely can't wait to come up again, ride MX 101 once again, but uh, that's about it for this vlog. Peace out guys.